Hey everyone, Jeremy here again. Uh, it's been one week and a day. I'm a little late on uh, posting the second video. Uh, this is about the Armor Fitness Arm Exercisers. I got the name right this time. Um, so I have them on now. Uh, I'm actually at work right now. So uh, I'll just show you a little bit that you can wear these while you're at work. Uh, I've been working all day, so I've been wearing these for about almost seven hours now. I have been wearing them just about every day. I skipped maybe one or two days. Um, but they are actually really good. Uh, a couple things I have noticed. Uh, one, for the uh, adjusters. Uh, do I have it? No. Um, once you get to a certain tension, uh, you actually have to start using, um, I mean, my fingers aren't as strong, but you actually start probably have to start using needle nose pliers to actually turn it to get it uh, tighter. And once you get to a certain uh, tension, you'll probably have to use them to loosen it as well. Uh, also, they do not show you, I said in the first video as well, um, show you what weight you're actually getting, what width resistance you're at. So right now, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm maybe at 10 pounds, maybe, maybe more. Um, but they're actually doing really well. I have noticed a uh, increase in muscle mass as well as um, toning. Um, so I'll go ahead and take these off. Now there are a couple of differences as well. Uh, I'll go ahead and show you this. Uh, the way this fits, uh, if you're wearing this under your clothes, you can still wear it under your clothes. Uh, however, the Velcro sometimes flips up like that. This is after a week and this is actually the straps are actually already starting to fail. Um, they did provide extra straps in the $108 package where you get the two, uh, the package that I got. Uh, if you get the wand, they probably do uh, give you some extra straps, but they do wear down fairly quickly. Now, I'm a out-of-shape guy that sweats a lot, so that's also probably another reason why uh, these straps also are failing. They're not the most comfortable thing to wear all day. Um, to get them to actually stay in position is kind of difficult, but for the most part, they are okay. Up here... Um, at the end of the arm exerciser, uh, this tends to dig into your skin. I have noticed that on this arm, I actually do have a little bit of a bruise from it, um, and on the inside as well. Uh, they need to put a little bit of like a pad or something there. If you are wearing them um, for extended periods of time, like I am, uh, I'd recommend getting the Under Armour um, skin, just a sleeve under both arms, and then you can wear them over it. I haven't tried it yet. I haven't been out to. Um, my local sport a good store yet to get some or Walmart or something like that Dick's but um, I'm gonna try that and by the next video hopefully um, depending but I'm gonna continue to wear these uh, I'm gonna go on for whatever I said in the first video I can't remember what I said but it probably a few probably two months so we're in no shave November uh, this is the second week of that uh, full effect um, but we'll definitely see so I'm gonna go ahead and take this off I'll show you what I mean by the marks on my arms. They're pretty easy to take off. Um, typically, what I would also recommend to take these off is go ahead and loosen the tension. Unfortunately, I don't have my uh, pliers with me to loosen it, so I'm just gonna show you real quick what I mean by taking these off, loosen the straps up, and voila, it's off. Now. See, I already got one more uh, tone in the uh, tricep area, as well as in the uh, bicep as well. Uh, you definitely feel it. Um, I do 100 reps, like I'll walk to work. I live only a mile and a half away. I'll walk to work and I'll do 100 reps, resting about uh, five minutes between, and then do another 100 um, on a relatively high tension. But you, as you can see, I got the marks from the straps they are itchy at first uh, they still are kind of itchy uh, that's also I recommend getting a uh, Under Armour sleeve um, if I wear them under my jacket a lot my jacket has the felt inside which velcro sticks to very easily so when you're putting on your jacket if it has it inside felt uh, the velcro may come off on you um, but to actually uh, put this on and wear it throughout the day is actually very good. I definitely recommend it. Um, just a few things I think, I mean, this is their 
first release for this, I think, I believe. I haven't seen any other YouTube videos except for that one guy's who was already uh, fit to begin with, unlike me. Um, and his recommendation, he recommended it too, and he also recommended the same thing, wear um, some Under Armour. So there you go. And the straps weren't too tight. They were actually decent. I actually might be just having a little bit of a reaction because the straps were new. Uh, they weren't used. Now this is what I mean by loosening them up because it's really actually difficult to bend them. And they're easy to store. You just store them, and that's it. So um, I'll see y'all again next week. I'll try to get it back on Thursday. Um, today is Friday the 10th. So I'll see y'all in another uh, seven days. So I'll just do it another Friday. Um, but yeah, that's it. If y'all have any questions, comments, concerns, uh, hit the like button, subscribe, and um, also answer it in the next video. All right. Y'all have a good one.